If you're a Verizon customer, you can get Disney Plus for one year for completely free. Good morning, everyone. Today, I'm here with another video describing how you can get information on the Disney Plus and Verizon deal that they have going on. If you're a Verizon customer, you can get Disney Plus for one year for completely free. Stay tuned in this video to see how. I wanted to let you know that this video is recorded a little different. I used a screen recording program, which I plan to use for possibly some other YouTube video ideas that I have going on. So no, all of my videos will not be switching to this format, but I may be uploading a like video per week on this type of format. So uh, this is just a little preview of it, kind of what that it may look like, and hopefully this will allow me to make videos like this, show you things on a computer a little easier with a little less editing by me because it's all in one program. Hope you guys enjoy the video. If you can, go ahead and give this video a like. Click that subscribe in the corner if you have not so that you can see what else is going on here. And yeah, let's get to uh, me from like an hour and a half ago. All right, so um, this is my first video like this. Complete amateur at this, have no earthly idea what I'm really doing. The name above me that's pink, it's pink because Kaylee's normally using this, but uh, I needed to use it today. I've also wanted to use it for like a, like a stupid news show or something because man, there is so much stupid news that a lot of people probably don't hear about that I hear about and I just completely laugh at. It's sad. Today what the about was Disney Plus teaming up with Verizon. Now, uh, this news came out about, a, I would say about two days ago, and basically, if you're a Verizon Fios customer, uh, which is their home internet service, if you have their unlimited 4G or their unlimited 5G wireless cellular package, you will get Disney Plus for one year for free. So from when it launches on November 12th, for an entire year, you can use it for free. Now, I'll be completely honest with you in saying that I had zero intentions of ever actually signing up for Disney+. Plus. I personally don't really like Disney movies. I like Lion King, and I like Toy Story, and to be honest, that's about it. I don't care for any of the other movies, but that's just me. So I didn't plan on spending $7 a month for this. I did want to try to get a trial and like do a YouTube video on it. So uh, by Verizon hooking me up for a year, that's even better. I'll be able to have it for a whole year. My daughter may like it. Apparently the Disney Plus app is going to be on Xbox, PlayStation, Roku's, Google. It's going to be on everything so that everybody can access it. And to be quite honest, by them doing this, uh, Verizon has, let's see, I don't know how many... Uh, Oh wait, let me go to Verizon Wireless. Maybe that's why. Alright, number of people on Verizon Wireless. So Verizon led the list in 2018 with 151 million subscribers, followed by AT&T with 143 million. So there's 151, we'll, we'll take this number, we'll say 155 million people who will have instant access to Disney+, Plus, Netflix, Users. So Netflix literally has 154 million total with 148 million paid. So if just half of the Verizon customers go over to Disney Plus and sign up, it's going to make Disney Plus look like it really just took off and it's just this amazing service that it may or may not actually be. It's just going to look like that due to the fact that they partnered with Verizon and that there's 155 million people who have a free account for 12 months. To me, what would be really interesting would be to see the Disney Plus numbers, I would say January of 2021, because that would be a full, like, 13 months after the launch, and uh, anybody on Verizon who has it for free, like myself, will have already canceled, so January 2021 would be a really good time to see exactly how many subscribers Disney Plus has because by then all the Verizon customers are either continuing to pay or they've said, I don't want this crap and they're not paying six bucks a month. 
But essentially, uh, there's a full posting on Verizon's website uh, about this on November 12th, and it details everything. They'll begin offering 12 months of Disney Plus to all existing 4G and 5G unlimited customers, new Fios home and 5G internet customers. Um, and basically, if you go to their website, which is verizon.com slash Disney Plus, spelled completely out, uh, you can enter in your email address right here, and of course, if you're a Verizon customer, you will get information on how to get your 12 months free of Disney Plus with Verizon. Good, it's all still recording. I'm going to put this link in the description. You can uh, just go, to, like I said, verizon.com slash Disney Plus, spelled out P-L-U-S, and uh, enter in your email address, and if you are a Verizon customer of 4G Unlimited, 5G Unlimited, or their 5G home or Fios home, you will be able to have Disney Plus for completely free for 12 months. I think that's going to do it for this video. Uh, sorry if the like quality's bad. I'm recording it on my phone because this mic's not as good, and I got to get a mic in here. I got to get this set up right, but uh, I hope to do it soon because I really want to try to do like a weekly, you know, like a Sunday stupid news or something. So like every Sunday, have a little video that comes out just talking about the stupid news of the week. But I think that will do it until next time. If you can, click a like on this video, click subscribe down in the corner, and uh, hopefully we will be back in the same setup, looking a little different, a little fancier, you know, better stuff up here and around me and stuff. But hopefully we'll see you back here soon. Mm -hmm. Hope that everyone has a good day. Deuces. <laughs> it don't work as well, because the whole screen don't, don't go away. Oh, deuces. and laptops. This is the X1 Extreme, but to have Dolby Atmos you need four speakers above your head. There's no way this laptop is anything close to Dolby Atmos.